Hi guys, this is Ranjit and as you can see I am here with this new TCL television and this is a 55 inch QLED television. This is a review unit that was sent to me almost about 10 days ago and this is their high end uh, what do you say uh, 4K television available uh, in India and this is the 55 inch variant and the speciality of this one is that it is a quantum dot that is a QLED television and as you can see at the bottom also we have a sound bar attached. It has a Onkyo sound bar that is attached and also it has far field microphones uh, so you don't have to actually you get a remote controller but you can just use it via voice and I'll show you all that and uh, this uh, first thing I noticed is that the build quality is actually really nice on this one this is the 55 inch variant there will also be other uh, sizes available I'll add that information uh, below uh, and uh, TCL reps also told me about the pricing for this 55 inch variant it will be 69,990 and I'll leave the links uh, where it's available in the description but uh, let's look at this television and the thing that st uh, stood out personally for me on this television was the picture quality and the sound picture quality because it's a QLED television and if you guys recall Samsung very hand high-end television that costs a couple of lakhs have that QLED technology and because it also has the sound bar attached it's actually a 50 watt uh, sound bar the audio quality is also very good and uh, it also has in terms of technical specification Dolby Vision as well as DTS audio as well as uh, Dolby Atmos audio and again it runs on uh, this what do you say uh, Android TV as you can see so it's very familiar uh, again you have popular apps that are pre-installed in fact Netflix is pre-installed even Prime Video was pre-installed on this one and let me just invoke it to you uh, so all these services are there for example Prime uh, 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 Video Netflix etc and again it also has a Play Store so you can install whatever you want and again as you can see you can navigate and stuff and the picture quality was the standout for example let me actually play this trailer itself and then we'll also play a 4k video to give you an idea let me just move out so as you can see it works very well let's just go back to home now and uh, again it also has netflix let me show you netflix let's just load it and as you can see it loaded Netflix pretty quickly and uh, again the picture quality is really good on uh, this one uh, but uh, apart from that uh one thing that I really liked on this one is that voice control as I've told you it has that far field microphones uh, yes uh, you also have a microphone in the remote but you don't have to actually remote uh, use the remote let me demonstrate to you so to test this always on far field technology I'm just uh, standing about six feet away and the hot keyword is actually okay Google what's the weather in Hyderabad Currently in Hyderabad, it's 29 degrees with hay. As you can see, it worked very well. And here also it glows in the white color when it's recognizing. Now let's try something complicated. Let's say you know a particular movie on an OTT channel uh, like let's say Netflix, etc. Will it do that? Let's try that and see if it works. Okay, Google. Play Mission Possible 4 on Netflix. Netflix. So let's see if it loads that movie. As you can see it worked. Not only it opened Netflix but open that particular movie so this far field uh, stuff actually works very well you can even control volume etc and I thought it was it would be a total gimmick but it works very well and uh, now moving to uh, what do you say other stuff and all these things obviously it is 4k and as you can see I installed Z and all these things and you also have this Google Play Store and from here you can install whatever apps you want like Hotstar etc so you have all the apps here you can search and use it let me just go back to the home interface back typical uh, what do you say uh, Android TV interface that you are getting so nothing uh, uh, that is different and uh, let me actually load YouTube and let me show you some 4k content to give you an idea how good the picture quality is so guys this is a YouTube app and let's search for some 4k content and uh, I'll give you an idea 
and let's just play this uh, first video it's 4k actually 60 guys so let's try to play it and make sure that internet connection is very good if you want to play 4k content but let's try to play this and as you can see it says hdr 10 and it also supports dolby vision this buffering is because of my internet connection i'll just pause it and let it buffer a little bit as i've told you your internet connection has to be amazing but let's look at the picture quality and as you can see very rich colors this is because of the qled i don't know if my camera is able to actually show you how good it is but if you notice how good is the picture quality and this is because of that qled quantum dot uh, panel that, that they are using and again as you can see 4k content no issues 4k it supports even hdr 10 plus let's so let's get out of this one uh, so the picture quality is very good another thing that i liked is the sound on this one the sound uh, uh, is also very good let's let me just try to search for some content and uh, play it back so that you have an idea so let's try to play this black panther uh, trailer because the audio i hope my microphone captures it So I'm just gonna get out of that. Don't want to fall into copyright issues, but hopefully that gives you an idea about the sound on this one. Moving to the ports from the bottom, as you can see, we have a headphone jack, then we have an AV for old television, then we have a USB, then we have one HDMI, total of three HDMI there. Also, we have optical out and antenna if you have that old uh, style one. And then we have a couple, two more HDMI inputs and on the top again, a USB 2 port. So in terms of ports, I would say you are fully covered. So to summarize, I would say what I liked about this television is the picture quality. I can't stress it. I don't know how well my camera is able to capture and reflect it. But in reality, the picture quality is really good. And that's due to the uh, QLED panel that is used. I have a very high-end Samsung television. And I would say the picture quality is almost close to that. By default, uh, the picture profile, uh, what it has, the standard, the colors are a little bit boosted. Uh, but you should go uh, in the settings and reduce the color a little bit and contrast. Then you'll get excellent picture and even the sound because of this on cue sound bar that we are having the sound impact was very good the dialogue delivery etc was very good so again that's the problem with many of the tv's internal speakers they just don't do a good job but here because of the sound bar that is uh, attached to this one it makes a huge difference and i also like that uh, voice recognition system you don't have to have a remote you can actually just say okay google reduce volume so as you can see it works so you don't have to have a remote and the, this actually i thought this would be a gimmick but that voice recognition uh, system because of the far field technology works really well on this one so certainly a very good uh, television for people who focus on picture quality and sound and apart from that it's an android television so you get all the apps uh, um, that are preloaded and most of the popular apps are available uh, and guys as i've told you this was the pre-production unit so in my testing i did notice that i was uh, getting a little bit of lag only in the youtube app and i did mention uh, ask what they say the tcl rep about this one i mentioned them and they told me mine is a pre-production unit in the retail units they'll be sending ot update to my unit later on they told me but in the retail Retail unit you shouldn't have an issue so overall I would say uh, this is a good television uh, particularly if you are picky about the picture quality the picture quality and the sound is what differentiates and I think so TCL you're paying that premium for that anyways guys that's it for now thanks for watching this is Ranjit and I hope to see you in my next video take care guys.